Hey, what's going on guys? Today I want to go over one through the mail autograph return I received a few days ago. And I want to ask you guys a question or show you what I do with my autographs. But first, let's um, open up the through the mail. It's a sports card. It's from Austin, Texas. Most likely football or baseball. But we'll see what we got here. Matt Moore from the San Francisco Giants. So this must be where he's at his minor league team in Austin, or he's sending it from his home address. Cool. So, Mr. Moore, thank you. That's awesome. I'll add that to the collection. And I want to ask you guys, what do you do with your autographs when you get them? Do you shove them in a box, in a binder? Do you, do you scan them and keep them on a, in the cloud? I, I keep mine in a binder, I, in binders, I have all behind my computer here, I've got about seven or eight, nine binders full of autographs, plus I scan them also, and I didn't initially do this in the beginning, years ago, I would just keep them in binders, but I finally woke up one day and a light went off and said I should just scan all these so I have a portable permanent record of all my autographs. And initially I used uh, Dropbox, but they have limited space available for free. And now I use Google Drive. They have still a limited space, but they have more available free space for average users to use. I think they provide 17 gigs of uh, hard drives or space, and I've only used two so far. So I've got quite a bit of uh, <coughs> room to grow my uh, collection. And plus I can take it anywhere. I back them up on Google Drive, and I have Google Drive on my phone, so I can reference my autographs whenever I want, wherever I want. They're right there on my phone. Plus, I keep a, a separate file, one on my computer and one on a, on a um, removable hard drive, just so I have a backup if for some reason one of the others should crash or fail or I can't access those. So I've got my autographs backed up three times. Um, on the computer, on a hard drive, and in the cloud with Google Drive. And I can add, I can just scan this one, and I'll toss it on Google Drive into the folder for my autograph cards, and it's there forever. And it's cool because you can pull out your phone, and if you, you can kind of show off, you kind of scroll through your phone and show off your autographs, whatever it is. Or you can just check them out when you're on, on the go, so to speak. And if you haven't scanned your autographs, I highly recommend you do that like I said I didn't do it for a while and, w and when I finally did it took me quite a while because I had a really poor scanner and um, I can only do so many at a time it took me a couple months just to scan those in my um, my free time and um, but yeah that's it my one through the mail uh, Matt Moore autograph right there thanks again Mr. Moore and back up your autographs at least put them in a binder, minimum. Protect them. Don't leave them floating around. They'll get damaged. And scan them if you have the time. And that way you, they're always there 24-7 on the go, at home, whatever. And it's much more convenient when I pick up my phone and I can just check out my autographs or kind of brag, show them off, whatever, to whoever. So, yeah, that's it for today. Really short video. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you next time. Later.